Inside vision, there is provision. The reason why there is no provision is because you have no vision. Yes, sir. If you have vision, there must be provision. Our ministry started as a vision. No money anywhere. But today, provision have come. Because there is a vision. This ministry started with anything. But today, because it is a vision, there are provisions. Life answers to vision. Prophecy. Your eyes must be open. The greatest deficiency of men is spiritual blindness. You don't know anything. Are you aware? If God open your eyes to know the people around you, you know go greet them good morning. If God open your eyes to know the people around you, The Bible says Jesus knew all men. He had the gift of vision. John chapter 2 verse 24. John 2 24. He knew all men. He knew all men. Look at that. Jesus did not commit himself unto them because he knew all men. Which means before you speak he knows your heart. In Mark chapter 5, when he wanted to heal that young man, Mark chapter 2, sorry, the man that was healed, that had palsy, the Bible said immediately he told the man, go, your sins are forgiven. The people around him, he saw their heart. He knew all men. Even you, the people around you, you don't know them. That's why things are not working. You need the gift of prophecy. Even if you can't call somebody's name, you know the gift of what God wants you to be. Joseph knew it. God made him for the palace. Am I speaking here? Paul knew it. God sent him to the Gentiles. That business you are doing, do you know why you are doing that business? Is that the business God wants you to do? Jesus was created as the savior of the world. But he was a carpenter. Missed, missed it until his time came. God took him back to his assignment. After this meeting, God will take you back to your assignment. God will take you back to your assignment. Hear me, sir. The first person you can prophesy to in your life is yourself. Let nobody prophesy to you who cannot prophesy to himself. You go to the bush. According to Peter Tlubabala, we say Otele Otombola. Otele Otombola. And he begin to tell you, you are going to be great. Babala, if you know great death, now you're inside bush. Eh? If you know I'm now you're inside bush, you know even wear clothes. The one where I wear better pass your own, you they tell me waiting I go be. That is blindness. That's why many of you are in trouble. That's why many of you are in trouble. You need the gift of prophecy. It's a gift. Your eyes need to be open. Your eyes need to be open. Gift of prophecy. The Bible says, Elisha prays, say, oh God, open the eyes of my son. Hear me. God will only do for you what you can see. Whatever you can see, God cannot do it for you. Jeremiah chapter 1 verse 11. Jeremiah 1 11 and 12. Jeremiah, what seest thou? Jeremiah said, I see the road of an almond tree. The Lord said, well, you have seen well. I will hasten my word to perform. Genesis 13 verse 14. Abraham, as far as your eyes can see. The Bible said, they look unto the Lord and their faces were lightened up and they were not ashamed. Psalm 34 from verse 5. You need to understand that vision guides destiny. And that is prophecy. Many of you don't know where. That's why your life is here. But listen to this. After this meeting, you will enter there. In the name of Jesus. 